Hi guys, welcome back. I know, inner stage, uh, stage left, I think. Every time I have to come through this way, it's getting boring. But uh, welcome back, I hope everybody's doing great. I've got a really simple project today. It's just covering lampshades. Because Lisa, you gave me this beautiful fabric and I told you I was gonna use it and I keep putting it off and putting it off and it's working its way into my cabinet and I thought, no, no, I'm gonna do something with this. And I have these old lampshades and I'm tired of looking at them. I dust them, I'm sick of them. So I worked on a little Hawaiian theme one for my Hawaiian little bar area in my house. And then I worked on this one and I'm just kind of revamping this one. So anyway, thank you everybody and thank you for subscribing. And I have a little board here. I wanna thank everybody. Uh, Cheat Meal Food Cat, thank you for the beautiful cards. I got two cards. Got the kitty cat one and got the Snoopy Valentine. And I love Snoopy, so, you know, you hit it out of the park on that one. And I want to thank Elvia Slots. She also commented a couple weeks ago, and I love watching your site. And Melly loves Slots. Melly, you're great. I love hearing your, uh, my accent is so Texan. At least I think it is. <laughs> or Southern. It might be Southern like Granny's accent, but... When I hear you, I'm thinking, I gotta travel, you know, I gotta get out, I gotta meet other people. So, Melly, Melly loves slots. Melly, wait, Melly loves slots. Yes, I wanna make sure I get that right. And Lucky Dog Slots, I'm getting a hat. I'm getting one of those hats. You watch, when I get to Vegas next time, I'm sporting one of those hats. So, I'm gonna tip it off to the side, too, just like Liza does. And Gambling Granny, you know, we're crazy about you. We watch you every Friday. Cheers. Cheers to everybody. So anyway, come watch this silly little video I've got today. So this was my first one. This was hilarious. This is just twine. I know it's crazy, right? Yeah, use what you have at home, twine. And all I did was I wanted a kind of a little shell theme, you know, like an ocean theme, you know, Hawaiian theme, I guess. So I took this and I just wrapped it. And you know, I thought, you know, I'm gonna test it out, make sure I don't burn the house down. And now it worked. It worked. It was far enough, you know, I didn't recreate the lamp. I just I just redecorated it. So I went around and around and around. And then I took this and I made these little flowers. And I and look, I can move them up and down. So if I don't like where they're positioned at, I can just slide them around. But this is so easy, you know, and, and they sell this twine anywhere. You can get it at Target, but I know it's at the dollar store because I'm pretty sure it was in my toolbox for a long time. And I looked at it and I thought, you know, I'm gonna make something out of this. And then all I did, I did not hot glue the shells down because, you know, I may not like this in a couple of months, knowing me, so. So what I did, I just slid the shells right in. Look, I just slide the little shells in and out. Isn't that cute? So I just, I just put those all along the bottom and just put those in here. Look, here's one right here. And I just slid it right in there. And I thought to myself, well, I've got to quit saying that. I thought it's a little bit different. You know, it's not perfect. It kind of looks homemade, but I don't care. I don't care. So anyway, I thought that was so cute. Oh, and what I was going to tell you is this chair behind me. I wanted y'all to look at this chair. Someone gave this to me and I, and I looked at it and I thought, why did I take this chair? And I showed Bunny, my friend, and I said, this is an ugly chair. My friend gave it to me. I don't really like it. And she looked at it and she said, oh no, you got to recover that chair. She said, you ought to get leopard print. And I like animal print, but I thought, I don't think I like animal print in my house. Well, she talked me into it. And let me tell you, it was a weekend project. All I did was hot glued it. And I, th I think I used hot glue and staples. And then I made the pillow. So I wanted y'all to look at this. So you never know what you have at home. You can revamp it, you can make it pretty. So all I did was I recovered it. And it's one of these old fashioned chairs. And you know, the woodwork was good. That's why I kept it because I like the wood legs and I like the handles. But I thought this is so funny and I did it a couple of years ago and I wanted to show you. So anyway, it was just crazy. Oh, straight up slots. I don't wanna forget y'all, you're great. Thank you, I enjoy watching y'all. Y'all are so funny. You remind me of me, you know, my husband and I. We're like, oh, you know, who pushed that, who pushed that button, you know? It was my money, it was my money. Uh, that's so us, we do that, we do that. So anyhow, okay, so here's a little, here's a little flower. And all I did was I cinched it in the middle and then you're gonna just take your twine, you know, I can just take the other little leftover twine, make it into a little flower or a bow and then just attach it. And look how easy that was. So I started working on two of them and I didn't wanna bore y'all with all the little 
stuff about it. So this was just so easy. You know, everybody has this stuff at home. And if you have an old lampshade, don't throw it out. Just save it, just redo it. So I added my shells and I added the twine. Super duper easy. So Lisa, this is the beautiful leather fabric you gave me. I love this. And I started working on it a little bit this morning and I thought, okay, I'm almost done. So I wanted to show y'all. I wanna show y'all real quick. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the border all the way around. I'm gonna take the border all the way around, but I'm having to cut and paste a little bit. So it didn't, it didn't just, you know, wrap around. I wish it would have, but no, it didn't. So what I'm doing is I'm gonna go ahead and, well, let me see how I'm doing this one. Okay. Okay, let me show you all this way so that y'all y'all can see what I'm doing. So I'm doing this, and I did have to cut. I know, it breaks my heart. I had to cut because it's kind of, it's going at an angle, you know. It's just going at an angle. I think my Bugsy music's up too loud, but sorry. Okay, so here we do. Yeah, here we go. Oh, and don't burn yourself. I already burned myself. Always, always, always. So I'm gonna wrap a little bit. I'm gonna wrap right there. I'm gonna start right there. And then I'm just gonna add this. I'm just gonna add this. If I can kind of show y'all, I'm pretty sure you get the picture. But you know, I wanted a lampshade deal. And I'm I'm going, I'm putting the loops in. And this was just an old lampshade. I had this. It's got kind of got like a French theme to it. And this was popular five years ago. I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it. I keep looking at it. Uh, oh, wait a minute, I'm backwards. Okay. And see, I wanted my border all the way around, so I left the thick part at the top. I think I'm gonna go this way, yeah. I'm gonna go this way. So, you know, I'll take a picture and I'll show y'all what it looked like at the end. But I was so impressed with this. I love it. And she, Lisa wants me to come up to Austin to go shopping with her to, to a warehouse where they have all this, but I'm like, mm, I'm not getting out much. So maybe, maybe in a month, maybe in a month. So we'll see, start, start doing stuff. And trust me, I'm dying to run down to Lake Charles. Oh my gosh. I just wanna run down to Lake Charles and go gamble. Mm. I can't stand it. I went to Galveston yesterday to get my mind off of it. But I thought to myself, oh my gosh. I was like, I don't want the world to open up and I don't wanna get sick. So, you know, I'm still here. I'm still here, sitting in Houston. So that's why I thank y'all. Your videos are great, I enjoy them. I enjoy doing this. So use your scissors, guys. If you're doing anything with glue, don't burn yourself. Don't burn yourself. It's, it's you know, so. So look, I have a, I kind of have a little bit of nails, not much anymore, but. And I noticed if you pull towards you, anytime you're redecorating or doing anything with fabric, always pull towards you. And it stretches out really nice. Cause if you go down, it, I notice it leaves little wrinkles. You don't want that, you don't want that. So I'm gonna put that in there. And what you do is let, glue it all first before you start cutting. Don't, don't cut. Don't cut as you go, because I guarantee your piece will be too short. It happens to me, I learned a long time ago. You start doing that. But I have to tell y'all, I <laughs> when I burned my finger earlier, <laughs> This is so funny. When I burned my finger earlier, I ran to the fridge to get a Coke. And instead of grabbing a, a Diet Coke, <laughs> I grabbed a beer, so I already drank it. <laughs> so I thought, it's open. I might as well just drink it. So I actually had a beer at 10, 10 o'clock this morning. So that's not good. <laughs> but I'm not going anywhere. I have to do some work. Oh, and I have a little, I have a little contest going. If you can guess, the first three people that guess who who my major crush was that I did a birthday tribute to on the last video or maybe the video before. If the if you can guess who who you know who I'm crazy about and you put it down there, the first three people, I'm gonna go ahead and send you a little care package. I'm gonna send you a little a little goodie bag. So anyhow, I love granny stuff, a little contest, and I thought I'm doing a contest. I thought so you'll get like a face mask or and a tissue cover. So anyway, I hope you like that. I have some really cool fabric, so. So you'll, I'll just surprise you. So anyway, and I'm at loves to sew purses at yahoo.com and it's L-U-V-S-T-O-S-E-W purses, P-U-R-S-E-S -E at yahoo.com. But just go ahead and put it on your comment. If you can guess who I was talking about, who I'm crazy about, my major crush, most beautiful man in the world. 
So anyway, you'll win. So the first three people, you'll be getting a little something in the mail. So just put it in there and I'll tell you if you win. And if you do, you can go ahead and give me your address on my, on my website. So, because I, I want a mask on Granny's website and I loved it. I was like, oh, I like it. I like my Crown Royal. I'm glad somebody was sewing me a face mask for once because I make them all the time. I'm making tons of them, so. Okay, y'all can kind of see how this is going. See where I'm going here. I love it. I love it, Lisa. I thought to, well, I'm not gonna say that. I'm looking around. I'm needing, I'm needing some redecorating in this house. Getting kind of sad. And silver makes everything kind of, you know, kind of pop. It kind of, kind of pops a little bit here. It's gonna look good in my living room. So it's gonna look, I have a little desk that this is on. It's gonna look great. It's gonna look great. I love it. So anyway. Okay, there it is. I hope you like it. This is just a simple project, guys. Like I tell you, don't throw anything away. I'm gonna show you this on a picture when it's done. And what I did was I took my border and I went along the top. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut the bottom border and I'm gonna go around the bottom. So that way I'll have a border on top and on bottom. But you know, it took a lot of cut and paste, you know? A lot of kind of, you know, cut and glue. But you know, it's just beautiful. It's just beautiful. Well, I won't show you that one. Okay, I'm not finished with that part, but I love it. So anyway, everybody take care. And this is just quick. I wanted to say hi, I was missing y'all. So be safe, everybody. Have a good, what is it? Have a good Tuesday, bye.